first things first you guys may be wondering where have you guys been why haven't you posted in a long time we definitely definitely will post a separate video explaining and talking to you guys about what we have been doing where we have been why we haven't posted in so long it's been so much going on all positive things all positive things that's been happening with the Harrison family in the Harrison household last video you seen I believe it might have been the gender reveal for the baby I think I'm not even sure that's how long it's been since we've posted a video um and we have a girl a beautiful baby girl um you guys will see her in this video so we are back guys and I kind of lost a love for YouTube I won't speak for Harvey um but me myself personally I kind of lost my drive for YouTube um but I think I got I've gotten it back I kind of just did I don't know like I kind of got lost in a sense um I was focusing my energy on other things for the family so YouTube kind of became like a back burner so I hope that you guys enjoy this video and I just want you to know that we are trying to come back to YouTube. Say hi. <laughs> What's up, YouTube? Um, we're trying our best. Woo! But she just like got a. You don't even know that you were grabbing my hair. You just grabbed it. Um, we're trying to bring our focus back to YouTube. We are trying to think of other ideas, fresh ideas, new ideas to bring to you guys because our kids, it's kind of like a reality TV show mm -hmm. in this house. And we want to share that with you guys. We want to share these memories. She go up. She go up, Dad. She go up. And that's our life, guys. That's what we've been dealing with. But um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And the holidays are coming up, so we definitely will be posting some holiday um, videos. But please, please, please enjoy this vlog. We love you guys. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. See y'all in the next one. As long as we got each other, we'll be just fine. Welcome to the Harrison family. Keep holding one another, we'll be just fine. Harrison family. What up, HD Nation? Be back with another video. So if you've gotten this far in the video, then you've already seen the clip before this one um, about where the Harrisons have been. Um, but here, say hi to the kiddo. Say hi. Hi. I'm gonna make this brief because I'm driving. Y'all know I don't like vlogging and driving. But Harvey is in his car. I'm in my car. We had to drop two cars today because. We're about to go do something very, very special. I'm super excited about it. Um, he's saying he's excited. He doesn't even know. They don't even know what we're about to go do. Um, they think that we're probably going to go to a park or something, which isn't the case. But um, you guys will see when we get there. But I'm super excited to be vlogging today, to be back today. A lot has been going on and eventually Harvey and I will sit down and tell you guys what's been happening. Excuse the lighting. The lighting is completely trash. Oh my God, is that better? Y'all, I'm normally a passenger princess when we go out as a family. I'm never really the one that drives. You guys know this. I need to get a car mount. Um, <laughs> I need to get a car mount because this is crazy. Let's see. Ugh. Um, so yeah, so we're currently on our way somewhere and we're driving now. Y'all, it's November the, what's today, the 12th? It's November 12th and it's 70 degrees here in Baltimore, Maryland. Um, can somebody say global warming? But it's really freaking hot. I'm about to put my window down. Um, like it's crazy. Like I feel like it's going to be a crazy winter. But we'll see y'all when we get where we're going and we will tell you guys what's going on, okay?
Are you saying hello? Hello, Mimi. What's up, HD Nation? We made it to our destination, guys, and we haven't been, it's so weird. We haven't been on this camera in a minute. I forgot what to do. Yikes. So we made it. The home. And you might be wondering why in the world y'all at home? That's the that's that's where y'all at. Why y'all at Home Depot? What's the what's the significance about that? Well, that right there. Okay, that's the significance. Let me zoom in so y'all can see. Period. That's the significance. The best time of the year, the best time of the season. Of course, the lighting is trash, so let me turn this way. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas, guys. If you have not already gotten into the Christmas spirit, please, please do so, because that's the best time of year. Mama, say hi to HD Nation, Mama. Say hi, say hello. Y'all see her hand? She's saying hi. So let's let's go. Let's get in here. See what we see what the excitement is about. Mean one, Miss the Grinch, y'all. The Grinch, probably one of my favorite Christmas movies. Period. They got Santa over here. This is glasses for me. Oh, look at the puppy. Too cute. Belly like a bowl full of jelly. So, if you guys want to know the theme that we're going for this year, silver gold and a little bit of blue they don't have blue we're going for like a royal blue like this one but they don't have any they got these the all red but they don't have the all blue so we're going to order the blue ones from amazon and go from there we're currently looking for other things we might need we have lights at the house already from last year i always want to do like a white light like the white lights. I don't think I like any other light other than the white ones. Um, our home is kind of like silver, gold, blue, grays. So we're going to stick with that thing to bring everything together. Um, but this is a start. If you are not doing your Christmas shopping right now, you're missing out because you want to get everything that you want now before everybody else comes and everything is gone so last minute you're scrambling trying to find what you should do for your home if you go early and get it out the way you ain't gotta worry about that it's not even thanksgiving yet i really like this next year i want to do a flock tree and harvey said to me so we just gonna keep buying trees every year why not we're back in the car right now. We're grabbing food and we're gonna go home. So, that didn't go as successful as I wanted it to go, as successful as I wanted it to go, because I was online before going to Home Depot, and um, they said that they had a lot more than they actually had. Um, although we were able to get 90% of the stuff that we need, we just need the royal blue ornaments, which I told y'all in the store that we were gonna, just going to get from Amazon. But um, they didn't have any tree skirts. They didn't really have like what we needed. Now, we didn't get any lights because we have a lot of lights. Like We still have lights from last year, the year before last. Um, so we ended up getting the tree that didn't have the lights on it because we have so many lights. We can just put the lights that we have at home on the tree, which made the tree 
a lot cheaper. Like I was saying, like if you are really into Christmas like me and my family, Christmas. shop before Thanksgiving and get what you need before Thanksgiving. So, cause you know, a lot of people get their stuff after Thanksgiving, like on Black Friday and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, the tree that we had at our old place, Yes, we moved. We'll update y'all on that later. Um, the tree that we had at our old place, um, we ended up tossing out when we moved. And I looked at Harvey and I said, you're going to have to get me another tree. Okay? And he was like, I, I don't mind, B. I will get you another tree. And he indeed got me another tree. Um, so, it's going to be really, really cute when we decorate. I'm still trying to figure out where everything will go. You got something you want to say? What you want to see? What? Uh, they need me honest, Y'all, he is obsessed with singing. <laughs> okay, fool. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're such a doll. So we're currently at McDonald's. They want McDonald's, y'all. I'm not too... Hi, can I... Guess who just pulled up beside me? <laughs> you don't see one without the other. Hi, HD Nation. Hi, Daddy. I Hi, told Daddy. them that you don't see one without the other. And that's on Daddy's period. So, y'all, we getting our food, and then y'all will see us when we get home, okay? Good morning, HD Nation. We are back today. This is probably maybe a week from the last clip that you just saw. I'm in the car with the kids. In the last clip, I did not have on anything. I had on a t-shirt and a dress. I wore a dress that day. Yo, we bundled up. This weather is so inconsistent, it really kills me. And I hate the lighting in this car well that's too bright but i'm gonna do it this way so you guys can see me better yes my hair looks crazy i just took my braids out so um i actually love this curl pattern and i could tell my hair grew a little bit i can't wait to wash it and blow it out and see the growth because y'all know me anytime i get braids locks i keep them in for a minute we are on our way to walmart i haven't started the car yet because i need to get gas so um, I'm gonna do my intro right now. Kids say good morning. Good morning. <laughs> um, so today we will be putting up the Christmas tree. Yay! So I actually need to find the lights. I was not able to find the lights, so I'll do that today when we get back. I need to go to Walmart um and grab some stuff. Like I said, the last time we were at Home Depot, I'm gonna see if Walmart has our blue ornaments today. And if not, we're gonna get them from Amazon. But this is my to-do list. As y'all can see the date. This is my to-do this. I need clear eyes because my baby girl, uh, my oldest girl, has pink eye. Um, I believe she got it from someone from school. So, I need to get some clear eye drops for her. Um, I need to get some more milk for the infant baby. I am no longer breastfeeding. That time is over. I breastfed her up until seven months. Um, I normally only do six. I did six with Ari. I did six with four. I did seven with with her um so i'm officially done breastfeeding she's now about to start foods um so she's about to start the phase of eating food um i'm gonna try this recipe that my oldest sister gave me um to give her like a little pancakes so i'm gonna try that today i need to actually add something to my list let me get some oats today um so i got clear eyes i need to get milk for the baby i need to get clothes for the baby because she's growing like a weed um i have blue ornaments and then i have pipe cleaners you might be wondering why do you got pipe cleaners on your list you guys will see why i'm adding pipe cleaners to my list so stay tuned for the rest of the vlog so you can see why those pipe cleaners are on my to-do list i mean my um shopping list and then i need to get oats so you can make baby pancakes with just oats um eggs what else did she say and I'm definitely going to do that because she said that her daughter tore it up. So, I can't wait because she doesn't like baby food. She, I even tried to make, I have a um baby Nutribullet and I tried to make her avocados and apples. She does not like baby food. She doesn't like mush. So, it's one egg, one ripe banana, half a cup of milk, and three-fourths cup of old-fashioned rolled oats. So, I'm going to try to do the um, pancake thing with her and see if she likes it. Um, First stop is gas because I need to get some gas let me show y'all where my gas at 
Look, the light finally came on. <laughs> um, let me see how many miles I got. Feel low. It won't even tell me how many miles I got. Um, so I'ma go get some gas. There's a gas station right up the street, and then we'll be on our way to Walmart. I'ma try not to make this um shopping uh situation long because i need to hurry up and come back home because i have a meeting at 11 o'clock um and it's currently 8 42 right now 8 42 a.m now y'all know diana be up early during the week so anytime i'm up this early on a weekend oh my god i love to sleep in because that's the moment that i get to sleep in but you know i'm excited christmas is coming up thanksgiving is this Yay. week so you know I'm, I'm excited. I'm hyped. The holidays are coming up. This is the best time of the year. Jesus was born. Your girl D was born. I mean, what more can you ask for? But anyway, let's get to this. Let's let's get to it. I'm sitting here blabbling. Y'all know I run my mouth too much and I apologize. But let's get into this vlog. I'm about to go get some gas and we'll see y'all when we get to Walmart. Hey y'all. I forgot to turn the camera on when we got here, but I'm currently trying to find some rolled oats for a mirror. And I found these old fashioned rolled oats whole grain. They look pretty, and it says organic. I've never heard of the brand Red Mill, Bob's Red Mill at that. Um, so I don't know which one. My sister didn't tell me a specific kind. I probably should have texted her. Um, but I know she didn't say steel cut oats, she said rolled. So I feel like I'm gonna just get those and see how that works. I will get the Quaker Oats, but they out of the roll ones. They just have the steel cut. And I don't want the steel cut. Cause the steel cut, as y'all can see, is kind of like, like that. Whereas though the roll is like that. Um, so we're gonna stick with these and see what happens. Now, yo, I done got stuff in my cart. You know how you go to Walmart or Target and you get stuff in your cart that you didn't have on your list? And that's what's happening. Come on, children. Why well, I got Funyuns in here? I got her milk, though. But why I got Funyuns and Tostitos and spinach dip? Y'all, I'm just a mess. And these kids, it's so difficult going to the market with children. Because they just don't stay still. Look at my angel. Hi, angel. Let's go. On to the next. I kind of want to get something holiday related for them. To do like in the morning during the holidays. Y'all want to make some gingerbread cookies? Yay! Y'all scared y'all sister. <laughs> I'm not scared. All right, come on. On to the next thing, cause I'm getting everything that's not on my list. Come on, this way. Anything involving anything with sugar, of course they're not gonna say no to. So I need to get her some snacks. Um. She, so I don't really do the Gerber brand anymore after they've been recalled. I just, when some, once something get recalled for me, I'm it, it's over for me. So I've been doing Beach Nut brand. Um, so now I'm trying to find like a little snack for her to eat. Like, you know, to be having a little crunchies. I see these. Earth's Best Organic Veggie Puffs. Let's see. Maybe we can try those. Let's see if I can find like some more. Okay, this is what I was looking for. The mini waffles, hidden veggies, in each bite. They go to brand, beach nut. So, I'm gonna try that. And, ooh, Parents' Choice has a oatmeal baby cereal. Hmm, let's try that too. You just add liquid. So let's try that. Because it's time for her to start eating other foods. And because she doesn't like the baby mush food, with the baby food, I'm gonna try to see what I can get her that she might like. And look, they got the Happy Baby Organic Snackers, Creamy Spinach and Curry. So I'm gonna stick with what I got for now and see how she does with them. And if she likes them, we can get more. This is just a trial run for her. Yo, before I left the house, Harvey told me I was gonna spend a thousand dollars on clothes for Mimi. And I told him I don't got a thousand dollars to spend. Yo, it's rough. It's rough when you have girls um, and they have so many cute clothes. Walmart and Target has the best, like, people be sleeping on them. Well, maybe y'all don't, but this cute 
little and they got it in mustard y'all know i be trying i'm looking for pipe cleaners and cannot find them um so i need pipe cleaners and i need clear eyes before i leave y'all should we do a gingerbread house this year hold on Got the gingerbread houses out already. You can't resist doing a gingerbread house every Christmas season. So I'm gonna throw that in the cart. It's not on my list, but I'm throwing it in the cart. And here we are. I really want. So what color should I get? It's like they all gone. 82 cent. I saw this on the TV. Here we go. I'm excited. Finally found the owl with the ornaments. So our theme of course is gold, silver, and blue. We were thinking about a royal blue. But as I'm looking, Let's see. A couple blues here. You got this blue, then you got that blue. Now my house has like a blue to it, like a blue tint to it on the walls. So I probably should call Harvey. Is it 10 o'clock yet? Because he's playing at a funeral right now. Shoot. Let me send him pictures and see what he said. This ice blue, I really like. I think it'll go great with gold and silver. What do you guys think? If you like the color, grab them. If you like the color, grab them. So I guess it's up to me. <laughs> Ma'am, what's wrong? What's wrong with you? You ready to get out of this chair? Yo, let me hurry up. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and get the ice blue. Cause it's sitting right next to the gold. And I think that's so pretty together. So I'm gonna grab two of those. Hey, I made it back home. I had to get the kids situated because they just was doing way too much. Way too much. But I'm about to do a haul for y'all so I can show y'all what all that I got. Now, I showed y'all my shopping list earlier, okay? But you know, anytime you go to Walmart, Target, anywhere, you always struggle to get just what's on your list. So, let's get into it. cannot celebrate the holidays without a gingerbread house and this one is like a mansion like normally we get the like normal ones but i'm really gonna be excited to do this one with the kids it has gingerbread men i'm real pressed um i think i get more excited than they do when it comes to that but yeah i got some slippers um from walmart so <laughs> like girl i got these for work okay um, I work at a law firm, I wear heels sometimes, and your girl feet be hurting. They are super comfortable. I try them in that, try them on at Walmart, and I love them. They kind of, they like Ugg dupes. They got the platform. They're not Uggs, but they're the Ugg dupe dupes. And I just got them just for me to throw them on at work. Um, when my feet get tired. Next, this is probably the biggest bag. Um, this is, I got all the stuff for the baby. Harvey told me I was gonna be spending a lot of money. I actually did good, okay? Um, I did good, I did good, I did good. Pat on the back for me. I got her some ones, like onesies. I don't know if y'all can see the lighting here. Oh yeah, you can see. And then it's a gray one with a little giraffe. Um, just because you know it, it's getting colder and sometimes Harvey just be wanting something to throw on her when he go and pick up Ari. So I got him these, just something. He loves simple stuff. He doesn't like complicated things. So if he could just grab this out the drawer and throw it on her and then go out the door, he loves that. I tried to find her like a coat. Um, she's in like six to nine months right now, like as far as her size is concerned. And I could not find a coat, like a baby coat for her. So I probably have to go somewhere like Old Navy or something. Um, I got this one, the simple things, white, just with the feet out, 
um she can wear her little socks i got her a mustard one y'all know i'm obsessed because it's a fall color i love this color i got her this one they look real big but it says six to nine um if y'all can see it says 69 so i feel like she could be able to fit this we we'll just have to see it on her she's grown so i feel like she could fit it of course you can never go wrong with getting these i got two short sleeve one long sleeve you could just throw these on under her clothes um so that you know she be gucci so i got three of those um let's see what's in this baby target target is my store when it comes down to shopping for the, the babies target old navy zara h&m love that so i seen this and this is so cute it's like ribbed i don't know if y'all yeah y'all can see it's ribbed and they got the pants to match i'm obsessed I was looking for more of these in different colors, but this is the only one. So I'm going to grab it. And this actually says three to six months. So I feel like she can fit it. I got my girl some jeans, you know, some more jeans. She only got one pair. So I got her some more. I got her some khakis, period. And I got her another pair. They like a green color. Y'all know my favorite color is green. And I got her some socks, some more socks, just like black, white, and gray. Um, just because it's getting a little colder, so she can have socks to wear with her shoes so her feet don't get cold. Um, is that all? That's all I got clothes wise. Wait, my baby texted me. Hold up. Um, and I also got these gingerbread cookie mix. So I've never made gingerbread cookies before. Um, so I got this. And one thing I'm a stickler for is doing activities with the kids during the holidays. Um, it's like I just, I get like I said I get just excited as they do, so I'm gonna get the little gingerbread thing and it says that you can make 17 cookies, so I'm definitely gonna do this with them as well as the gingerbread house and I'm gonna vlog it so y'all can see. We're not doing vlogmas this year because we just moved into this house in like July, or June, one of those months, June or July. So we're still kind of trying to make our house our home. And I feel like that'll be too much to do vlogmas, vlogging every day. Um, so we're just going to do some Christmas videos and then post them during December, um, during vlogmas. So we're not going to do every single day because I know we did that one year. And when I tell y'all, your girl was tired. I mean, same day editing, same day posting, making sure I got it to y'all before 12 midnight was a struggle. But we did it. We did all 25 days. And I'm proud of, I'm proud, proud of us. But I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it this year. Maybe next year. Um, I got her some plum organics pur puree. Y'all know these little things right here. So she doesn't like the mushy. Like she doesn't like the food. She doesn't like even when I make the food. So gonna try these i feel like she's probably not going to pay them any mind but i just got them just to try um let's see i got her milk she does the simply plant-based um if you're struggling to figure out what milk to get your baby my sister told me about this um i was exclusively breastfeeding her until my supply went down so you know i did everything i could to get my supply to go back up and i started taking supplements i started drinking drinks i started drinking mother's tea and i got really really sick um i was sick for weeks and once i stopped taking all that i was taking i got better so i feel like those things that i was taking was affecting my body um and then my, my milk supply wasn't even increasing the way that i wanted it to so i had to stop taking everything that i was taking and just go back to just drinking a lot a lot of water and i was drinking body armors body armors helped a lot too Co anything coconut water based is good for you but i just got this to supplement just in case my milk supply went all the way down now i was exclusively breastfeeding her up until five months and that's when my supplies started going crazy so i got this supplement just in case like i completely could not produce for, produce any milk for her so that she still had something um similac and regular and familiar neuro pro would make her projectile vomit so i was like uh-uh um, so I was like, I need something that will stay down. So my sister recommended this to me and I'm really, really, really happy about it. It's plant-based and she loves it. So I got a couple cans of these because this girl, she's drinking six to eight ounces right now. It depends on the day. Sometimes she does six ounces. Sometimes she does eight. 
Um, so I just got some more milk for my girl. Make sure she's taken care of. I got her some puffs. Um, I got these for her, just something for her to snack on when she's with us, like when we're somewhere. I got some spinach dip. I'm probably about to have some of this right now because I'm hungry. Probably about to make some breakfast. I got some pipe cleaners. Um, Y'all will know why I got these later on in the vlog. Um, I got the oats. I told y'all about the oats that I got um, for her pancakes. I got me some seeds. I'm obsessed with sunflower seeds. And I got some clear eyes for my girl Ari because she got pink eye. Two more bags, y'all. All right, so I got her some more puffs. This brand is Earth's Best Organic. I don't know if you guys can see. Um, and they're like veggie puffs. So, you know, trying to see what else I can get my girl um, to, you know, snack on. I got her some mini waffles. We got vegetables in it from Beach Nut. Beach Nut is my brand. Love them. I got some Perch Choice Oatmeal. So I'm going to try this out. It says just to add liquid. So maybe milk or water. We'll see. Or breast milk. Um, all my breast milk gone. So I guess it'll be water. And I'm going to give her this if she likes that. I got some chips to go with the spinach dip. Um, I got some Funyuns because I'm obsessed with these right now. I'm not sure why. And no, I'm not pregnant. I'm just obsessed with Funyuns right now. And then I got these. Um, I got the little ones so that I can pack them in Ari's lunch um, when she goes to school so that it's, you know, an easier to go thing. Um, I'm always thinking about what different things I can get for her lunch box. Let's see the variety. And then I got these. I got about four of these or three. No, I got three of these. Let me show you guys the other pair. The other two because I feel like this ice blue will go really well with these two. Um... So I got, let me show you all. We got silver, we got gold, and then we got the ice blue to go with it. I feel like the three of these together are gonna go really, really nice. And we did silver and gold last year and I loved it. I was obsessed with it. So I thought we should add a little bit of blue because there is blue in our home. Our accent pillows is blue. Now I need to put all of this stuff away. Y'all see all of this. Now I need to put it away. I cleaned yesterday. We're hosting Thanksgiving. So we got to do a deep, deep, deep clean this week. So that we can have guests over. Um, so let me put all of this stuff away. And then Harvey texted me. And said that he wanted sushi. I was actually about to make like a breakfast sandwich. But if he's getting sushi. Then I'll probably just wait until he gets back. So I'm going to see what he say. I'm going to put this stuff away. And the next time you you see us, we will be decorating. Now, what I need to do right now is go downstairs in my basement and try to find the Christmas lights. Um, because we got like four or five um, packs of Christmas lights. Time to clean. <laughs> My living room look kind of crazy. I am about to shift the couches over. Um, so just to show you guys a little bit, um, I'm sweeping right now and I'm about to vacuum. I'm watching Real Housewives of Atlanta season nine um, while I do this, but the tree will go over here um, in this area. This is kind of like our bookshelf area. 
um, don't mind those right there those shoes are there because I'm taking them to work on Monday but the tree's gonna go here this mirror is gonna go up on the wall because it matches the floors really well um so we had to move the couch over so everything looks crazy but all of this was here now we need to shift it over a little bit so that we can find space in that corner for the tree to go um so and then this back here we're gonna put Christmas decorations here Harvey has to get the lights because there's stuff on top of the lights downstairs in the basement and I'm not lifting nothing. That's what husbands are for, right? So, I'm going to sweep. I'm going to vacuum. Um, having children is one of the most joyful, rewarding things ever. But it's also a hot mess because the stuff that I just found under my couch or by my couch. This is a brand new house, y'all. We moved in in June. It was brand new. Your kids will definitely. Anyway, that's another conversation for another day. I am about to shift and vacuum and then start opening up the box to set the tree up. So, let's do this. And once again, y'all my hair. I know, I haven't gotten to it yet. We will get to it today. Sometime today. I'll get to it. But, yeah, just watch me. I'm going to set y'all up right here. Um, his house has natu great natural light, but it also says have, have good light lighting. Pipe cleaners. Blue gun, just in case, not sure why. So this is a special ornament um, that we hold dear. Um, when we did Vlogmas, we did ornament decorations and Harvey did this one, the father. And he put all of our names on it and a chunk for Ari. Where's Ari? Ari's name is right here. We have to add Mimi a mirror on this and we're gonna hang that one because that's like an every year thing i found our lights um it's four of them yay so i had to untangle them all of these are white lights so yay fun um some of our tobacco as you can see the trees all the way over there everything looks crazy right now but trust me it's going to be pulled all together um you can see this right here i got it blue because the ornaments are blue um that's the fireplace over there looks crazy that's just all of the pillows and stuff um so it's gonna be really really cute i'm thinking about lining up some lights around the island on the tree and then putting some on our back deck we have a deck in the backyard so I think I want to hang lights around there. I kind of don't know where the placement will really go. So I'm trying to figure all of that out as I go. I just know that the tree is going in that area. So I'm going to finesse everything else and see what looks good where. And let's do this thing. I'm about to vacuum and then I'll unbox the tree.
here comes the best part of the tree. I feel like this has been an all day process. It is currently 4.15 and I've been up since 7.30 a.m. So I'm tired. But you guys are probably trying to decide, figure out why I got these type cleaners. I thought I'm going to try to use all of the green first because it blends in with the tree. Um, and I realized that we had some old ones from our old house that I forgot that we had. Yay. Probably could have saved some coins, but it's all good because these is only 82 cents. Um, so I'm going to start with the green and then I'll probably use the red or maybe the yellow because the yellow might blend a little better too. So, it's the DIY. I've seen this on TikTok. TikTok shows you everything. So, cluster ornaments. So, you know how you put each ornament on the tree individually? This year, I've seen people putting clusters of ornaments together and then putting them on the tree in a cluster. And I thought it was so cute. So what we're going to do is put the blue together, put the gold all together, and put the silver all together. So as you can see, it's three of them all together. Now, should we do four or three? Yeah, I think whatever, all the different designs... Yeah. Put on it. Put on it. What are you saying? Okay. So it's five different designs. Yeah, it's gonna be dope. Okay. So you put five on here, so you'll kind of see all five of them, mm -hmm. and that's super cute. So let's Can I hold it. Hold on one second, four. We gotta test to see how it fits, and then we'll do it for each color. Let me set y'all up somewhere so y'all can see. Maybe right here. Perfect. She twirled this around and she placed it where, you know, you can place it wherever you want to go, but we doing this all around the tree or we doing some individual. So I thought, like, I thought, you, I thought what I saw was, you know what I mean? A design like she did. Yeah, it came around. Okay. okay. So yeah, she did like kind of like a, 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 Oh, that's kind. Of, that's kind of gonna be cute. But we doing all different colors, or we doing three different lines? It'll be three different lines. Okay. So we're gonna do three different lines going around. So I'll use blue as the middle, and then maybe gold on top, silver on the bottom. So let's kind of place it. Okay. So you see how the silk, the, the sparkly one is here? You want me to push it down the bottom? Yeah, yeah, it's, matter of fact, it's, it's all right. Like, it's going to be, it's going to be, it's going to be nice regardless. So, if you can see on the tree, it's a cluster all together versus just being one ornament. Now, I'm going to tidy, tidy it up so that it's like, more like this rather than dangling. So, let me do that. But, you can kind of get an idea of where we're going with it, okay? So I'm going to do this for all three colors and then I'll be back to show you guys what it looks like. Hey y'all, let me pause the TV real quick so y'all can hear me. I can care less about our house and I Seemed like that took forever, but we're finally done the tree. We're not done the full house, we just did the tree. And let me show y'all what it looks like. Ta-da! So as our star, we have the cluster of ornaments. It's a little sideways, but I'm gonna fix it. It's gonna be straight when I'm done. And here we are. what you guys think about this tree in the comment section below thank you for watching this video um when we do the rest of the decorations for the house we'll vlog that in a whole separate vlog but this was a little lengthy vlog um but thanks we're trying to come back so give us more ideas to do as far as videos are concerned um we're going to try to make sure that we stay consistent but thanks for watching this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. We love you guys. Happy holidays. Have a wonderful Thanksgiving and have a wonderful Christmas.